RC Maniacs. Hey guys, welcome back. So, thought I would do a little update and uh, yeah, the next part in my Tamiya build series. So, as you might remember, we ended the last video with uh, me accidentally skipping over this part. So, I took the liberty to finish that off screen or off camera, which was these arms here in the front and the rear suspension arms so if you haven't seen the first part of this series I highly recommend that you go back and do that before you watch this if you're interested of course so now we're here on page 7 and it's time to fit the motor which I've got here remove rubber tubing it says so this is the uh, torque tuned motor not the uh, standard can so that's pretty nice and uh, yeah I'm going to do as I did in the earlier video I'm just going to build this and uh, speed up some parts of it or most of the parts and if you're interested in seeing any of it in slower pace just uh, hit that settings cogwheel and slow down the pace and uh, you should be able to get a pretty good look at what I'm doing so yeah I'm going to fit the motor and uh, this is a 540 motor of course I think you, most of you already know that but I'll just mention that anyways
Okay, so I'm a little farther down the way here. Okay. Motor in place. It feels a little tight with the spur, but I guess it will be fine once we drive it around a little bit. It's okay, so flipped it over and uh, yeah, let's uh, keep going, I guess.
Okay, so this video is running a bit long. This is supposed to be a build series, so no rush, I guess. But uh, yeah, so today we attached all the uh, suspension arms, front and back, as well as the dog bones and the hub here in the rear. Again, ideal what the suspension travel would look, would look like. Not a ton of travel, but I guess it's enough for this type of. Uh, vehicle so that's where we're at at the moment also attached the motor today so that's nice and yeah this is really fun this far I'm really impressed by the quality of the parts and the chassis and the plastic it all feels really nice so I'm really enjoying my first uh, Tamiya kit experience here Definitely recommend picking one of these up. It's a lot of fun. And uh, yeah, it's Christmas soon, and maybe some time off from work during the holidays and stuff like that. So that's a great little kit to build with your kid or just for yourself. Because that's what I'm doing. I'm really enjoying it. So I hope you like this part and uh, that you don't find it too boring. But uh, I think I'm pretty sure someone out there finds this a little bit helpful or even a little bit entertaining so uh, I'll leave it at that this time and uh, let's well I guess we'll see how far we'll come in the next video also got a ton of unboxing videos coming got these I uh, can't really remember the brand name but uh, there's four different types of these same platforms so I've got all those coming and some other cool stuff so make sure to subscribe and uh, please leave a comment let me know what you think